So next in the Fever series is Fever. I designed this after watching Dua Lupa in concert. And she does a song called Fever. And I kind of loved it. And I was completely taken away by the concept. And she's singing about colours. In that. So that's where this inspiration came from. I think she says something about red. And says something about fever in the song. I love it. So I've been, I was listening to that over and over. So that's where the inspiration came from. So fever is a tube rose fragrance. And it contains authentic Indian tube rose. That's been distilled and processed in France. Very, very high quality tube rose. So this smells of vanilla, tonka, tube rose, floral. It's incredibly delicious. So I'm going to apply the fragrance and I'm going to sort of talk to you about it. If you've not seen my atomizers before, I'm going to show you because, you know. Yes, I'm very proud of my work. You know, I'm always taking it up a level. I'm never satisfied with, uh, you know, anything but Sika. So this is gorgeous. I've not smelled this in a while. So this is bright, light, airy, vanilla, light, substantial tube rose absolutely at the core so this is why i was been showing it because tube rose is a difficult raw material to work with so this absolutely has tube rose in so tube rose and vanillin molecules and wood raw materials and citrus tends to give you a sort of little bit like very very expensive suntan lotion that sort of delicious vanilla sort of whipped vanilla, slightly spicy, gives you that. But what I want to say is that unlike uh, tuberose fragrances, which are primarily aroma chemicals that smell like plastical, Fever does not because I'm using authentic tuberose. It's so eloquent, so, so beautiful. Men and women absolutely could wear Fever if you love that sort of like very vanillic fragrances. Always get a 10 mil to try the, the, any fragrance. That's why we do 10 mils because, you know, it may not be for you. Just so gorgeous, sweet, bright, airy, tube rose right at the core. It's got a sort of slight fruit quality as well, like a sort of slightly green, banana y. It's very English, wasn't it? Banana. A banana. A banana note in it as well, which is sort of green. So this is just beautifully balanced between sweetness, vanilla, wood notes, and a green note to it as well. Very lovely. Uh, I wore this in uh, wore this in Mexico quite a lot. And the CR from it is just really beautiful. Very intoxicating. Really gives you that sort of fever. 